How's it going everybody? This is Beat the Bush. And so you guys, at the most inconvenient time, because I'm in the middle of dinner, the subscriber count is inching towards 100,000 right now. It's 99,994. Now some of you have tried to estimate when this is gonna happen. It's gonna go, oh, within the next day or so. The average subscriber count tends to be about 15 per hour. Now this rate varies a little bit, but currently that's what it is. It's probably gonna happen within the next 20 minutes. You might be wondering what the heck of a typical dinner I'm having. I'm just having leftovers right now. Rice with some cucumbers cut into little strings kind of like noodles. I'm eating some free-range chicken, pig feet, mushroom, and some of this fungus that kind of looks like very thin hair. Something I wonder if a new subscriber comes in and they see 99,999, they'd be more likely to subscribe than if it was like some other odd number. So if I see it at this point, maybe they'll be like bam bam bam, you know, just in a few minutes, all of a sudden it'll go over the 100,000 mark or something. So 15 per hour means roughly on average every four minutes I should get a new subscriber. Four more, four minutes means in 16 minutes here. So what are you doing tonight? I'm waiting at home so that my subscriber account will reach a hundred thousand <laughs> yeah this is uh the this is exactly what happened i started this youtube channel january 11th 2014. this has been about a four-year journey and i would not be here without those initial 100 uh -huh. in roughly two more months it will be my four-year mark of making youtube videos i know some channels they go to a hundred thousand subscriber much faster than myself but I go at my own pace basically. Let me share with you some history on this channel, how long it actually takes to reach certain milestones. Well, there goes another one. Three more subscribers or about 12 more minutes. I think reaching this point takes the building blocks of the initial subscribers. They build on top of each other and well, I can't subscribe to myself Actually, I can, but I definitely don't have 100,000 accounts to subscribe all to myself here. This required the support of all of you guys, of course. Now, from the beginning, I was very reluctant to even open up a YouTube channel. I'm like, well, I'm gonna make a video out there and it's gonna be public. I'm like a pretty private person. So on January 11, 2014, I made up this name, Beat the Bush. It was just, you know, in retrospect, it might be a bad name or a good name. I don't know. Um, sometimes I have a strange connotation to it, but I'm sticking with beating around the bushes as in short for beating around the bushes. It took me six months to reach 100, but of course back then I only uploaded maybe once a month, once every three weeks or so. Once I reach 100, I upload it a bit more often because I'm like, hey, wow, there's actually people watching, so I should like put in more effort. So it's kind of like a self-feeding thing. Nine more months to reach 1,000. Another year to reach 10,000, and after that, it actually took me one year and eight months to reach this 100,000. Of course, it's not 100,000 yet. I don't really want to jinx myself. Maybe uh, once it hit 100,000, it'll drop. And I've seen channels like this. I'm not sure what goes on with those kind of channels where they reach 100,000. People just started to change everything, and somehow people started unsubscribing. Now, the way YouTube works is once you reach 100,000, um, even if you drop below that 100,000, you'll still be eligible to get that silver play button. So I've been eyeing that thing, I think since uh, 10,000. I think since 10,000, I started thinking, oh wow, 9999. Okay, should I stop talking? I think when I reached 10,000, I started thinking, hey, maybe it might be possible to reach 100,000. You see, it took me one whole year to get 10,000. So if you extrapolate, Every 10,000, it takes me another year. It means, hey, if I work at this at the current pace for nine more years, then maybe I'll get 100,000. But no, instead, it's one year, eight months. So this goes to show that when you put on a constant amount of effort, the subscriber increases is exponential. So every order of magnitude takes roughly about the same time as the previous order of magnitude. See, six months, nine months, one year, one year, eight months. So it is taking me a little bit longer to increase by one order of magnitude. Going by this, it probably going to take me maybe two and a half years to reach 1 million. So you guys think, oh, another year? I don't know. It seems kind of difficult to reach 1 million within one year. My channel hasn't really been growing all that fast. Um, you know, that fast compared to, you know, more popular channels. So my realistic estimate here is maybe if I, oh, if I, oh, ah, uh, okay. I wonder if it's going to drop down by one. If it drops down by one, someone sees a hundred thousand and then they, oh yeah, someone just did it. I can't Okay, so it's not 100,000 yet. Oh, there it goes back. Maybe they wanted to like 
unsubscribe just to see oh did i really change it to 100,000? so this has been three years and 10 months in the making i think every youtuber when they begin they think they want to reach you know very high heights when i started when i saw another channel that has a thousand subscriber i'm like wow what will i give to be at 1000 and because i was at like 50 i'm like oh my gosh you know you're just drooling you're like oh my gosh i want 1000 and then when you're at 1000 it's like oh my gosh you know getting to 10,000 it'll be just crazy now i'm at 100,000 and i think going to 1 million is kind of crazy i'm thinking it'll probably take me 2 years 6 months so probably june of 2020 however if i put more and more effort in maybe I find out some trick or something maybe I you know do something better and better maybe I can do it within one year I don't know I think this was a really good marketing thing when they introduced those play buttons because then everybody has a certain goal I think those play buttons they give it to you and they also include some sort of like $500 gift card to buy more equipment and stuff let me go grab my milk tea it went up by one while I was gone didn't it uh, oh well usually it doesn't drop by like a couple but it could. So I'm gonna watch this some more until maybe it hits like four or five, I think. 100,004 or five. So I checked my YouTube dashboard. Apparently it does not automatically see 100,000 and then send you the notification. Probably there's some sort of delay, I don't know, but I think I should get a notification where I can uh, go and order it soon, I think. The silver play button, I mean. Sometimes when I think about how much work I put into this, wow. Four years, that's four years a long time. To work towards one single goal, uh, something really nice comes out of it. Do I have to wait longer? 100,003. I guess this moment at least deserves me just looking at it and having my favorite milk tea thing. I think I can leave now. It's not gonna drop, I think. One interesting thing that I wanna tell you guys is that when you're on socialblade.com and you have a channel that has very close to 100,000 subscribers there's a subscriber rank here and they rank them by number of subscribers of course by this number you can just go oh there are 55,608 channels that has 100,000 subscribers or more 55,000 is about the size of a you know medium sized town these people are scattered all over the world so um, I don't know how many of these are in California. How many of these are in the Bay Area? So thanks for sharing this exciting moment with me Don't forget to give me a like on this video and subscribe. Thanks for watching